Uh, let's get the point first. The point is going to be where x is equal to 4. And then i got to plug it in. i got to get the y. And what's y going to be equal to? Log base 6. And you get 2x4. Well, you're going to get, if, if I square it for 16, 2 times 16 is 32. And 32 plus 4 is 36. I realize, you know, certainly you're looking at logs, you wouldn't know how to do that over there. Let me just write this, you know, log base 6, 36. You know, basically it's the power. 6 to the second power is 36. So this just equals the number 2. Right, relatively simple. Something you learned back in math um, 119. So what I'm going to do now is erase this over here. I'm kind of done with this. I'm even done with this because a lot of people say they could do that in their head, and you probably should do that in your head. Now I got a, I got another problem. I got to get the slope. How do I do that? Well, one, I'm going to use a base change formula. So I'm going to write y equals. This is going to be the natural log of two x squared plus four over the natural log of six. I'm using a base change formula. Now I want to write down dy dx. And what's that going to be equal to? Let's be careful here. It's going to be one over the argument. Before I do anything, I know there's a constant of <coughs> ln 6 in the bottom. What's the argument going to be? 2x squared plus 4. Pretty simple. What goes on top is the derivative of the uh, argument, which is, um, you know, 4x. I want dy dx at x equals 4. And this is the slope of the tangent line. So what do you get there? 16 on top. You get natural log of 6. And if you square again, we just did it. It's squaring the 4 is 16. 2 times 16 is 32. And 32 uh, plus 4 is 36. I want to reduce that. And looking at that, I'm going to say by 4. So 4 goes into 16 4 times. It goes into 36 9 times. And you have an ln 6 over here. All right? There's not much I can do about that. Um, but I can write the equation of the tangent line down, which is going to be y minus y1. Let me remind you, this is our point, so it's going to be 2, equals 4, this is the slope, 9, ln 6, and it's going to be x minus 4. I'd say it's a good-looking answer. Uh, again, a lot of teachers are emphasizing that you solve this for y. i write that down for you. And it's going to be x minus 4, plus 2. Again, I don't see that adding much to the problem, but you could do that. Let's look at the k, see how we did. Um, was I able to get this over here, y minus 2? Uh, yep, I got this. Was I able to get this? Let's see if I got that right. Yeah, things are moving along. Thank you.